Okay, so... I just need to take off some layers to get to the stuff. I forgot, or lost actually, the list. So I'm just going with what I saw in the video. And so, yeah. Uh, starting with the psoas muscles and the iliac is so as minor, so as major. Why isn't it clicking on so as major? Minor, major, and iliacus. He mentioned those. Okay, so now I'll just try and work my way down. A uh, pubic thing, don't think I have to worry about that. Oh, hey, my accent clicked on those again. Okay, well, there you go. And going down, let's see how this goes. Everybody knows the opectinius, he definitely mentioned that. No, the pectinius. Abductor longus, gracilis, abductor magnus, and then back the other way, I think. No, I'll just keep going. Okay, semitendinosis, semimembranosis, semitendinosis, semimembranosis. Let's see. Keep going. Don't give up even though you want to sleep. Biceps femoris longus. Vastus lateralis. Oh, wait, what's going on here? Intermedialis. That should be the... What's going on? Uh-oh. Well, that's not right. What? I think I... But I deleted the rectus femoris, which you will see is over on the other thigh. Right there, rectus femoris. And then there's supposed to be... Vastus medialis. There we go. I got it back. Okay, so wait. Vastus intermedialis. Intermediate. Right? And then rectus femoris, vastus intermedialis, rectus femoris, vastus intermedialis. And now what? Where do we go now from here? Vastus intermedialis, vastus medialis, vastus lateralis. And forward hoe onto the iliotibial tract, the tensor fascia latte, and then again iliotibial tract, and now on to the lower leg because yeah, why not? Gastrocnemius, that's the easiest one. Gastrocnemius. Below that is what you know. Uh, I can't find it again because I deleted it. <laughs> so hang on. All right, here we go. I'm going to pause this and then come back once I have everything back in order. Uh, and okay, here we go. We're back. And underneath this is the soleus. Yes, the soleus. And let's see. This gets a little bit confusing now because I've deleted some muscles. So I'm going to start over in a little bit, but I'm going to go through them as we go and see what's missing. So, the soleus is there, now it's gone, and now we're on to tibius, tibialis posterior, and there's the tibialis anterior, and then back to the tibialis posterior, where are you? There you are. And now, let's see, what's this one? Ooh, flexor digitorum longus, so remember that's medial. It's on the medial side of the leg, flexor digitorum longus, and then I'll grab the flexor Nope, that, that one I don't think matters. I keep clicking on it. And flexor hallucis longus, that's important. Go to the big toe. So, super important. Uh, and we're going to get to the other one on the other side as soon as I stop clicking on these. Flexor hallucis, flexor digitorum longus, flexor hallucis, flexor digitorum longus. They are right next to each other. Uh, I recorded this without sound, so now I'm doing the sound in case you think it's kind of confusing. Sorry. Uh, tibia. We don't need that bone. <laughs> uh, extensor hallucis longus. That's what I was trying to get to. Extensor hallucis longus. Fibularis. Tertius. Don't need that guy. So I'm going to pause. There we go. I brought all the muscles back and here we go. With all the muscles present, let's do it again. Extensor hallucis longus, and then extensor hallucis longus again on either side. You can see it's right next to the uh, anterior tibialis or tibialis anterior. 
and then I'm gonna swing over to the back and see if I can find the posterior tibialis. Let's see, Velusis. What did I just do with that? What am I doing? Fibularis longus. Soleus. It's important that you can see it without him taking stuff off. Gastrocnemius. Soleus. Gastrocnemius. Soleus. Gastrocnemius. Fibularis. And the Fibularis brevis is right under that too. I'll get to that in a bit. I forgot about it. Gastrocnemius. Aeus. And the computer just went blank. Oh, I'm back. And now on to, yes, the tibialis posterior. Now I'll go to the front. Tibialis, oh wait, why? Flexor hallucis longus. Okay, well I guess I'm not going to the front. And plantaris gone the way again. Flexor digitorum longus. Let's see if I can do this back and forth a bit. Flexor digitorum longus. And then we're going to do extensor digitorum longus, I think. Let's see if we do that. That would be my logical conclusion. Uh, I would think that's what I would do. No, I did extensor hallucis longus. Okay, so I did it wrong. Let's see. Uh, yeah, there we go. No, I didn't. Wow. This part is not so easy. Flexor digitorum longus. And... Flexor hallucis longus. So that's a really big muscle back there, surprisingly. And then we have the extensor hallucis longus. So I'm gonna, I think I select both of them right here and then try and pair them together. Yes, looks like I did. Okay. Flexor hallucis longus. Flip back around to the other side. Uh, I, I wish I had shown you better that it runs along the toe, the big toe. Just like the flexors run along all the other toes, uh, but the hallucis toe ones run along the big toe. That is a flexor one. It looks like it might go to the big toe, but it actually goes to the digitorum, the other toes. So flexor digitorum longus. And now let's see if I do a better job with this. The flexor hallucis longus and go back around and see if I can show you how it runs along the toe, or not. Oh, I, in that one it does, okay. Extensor hallucis longus and flexor hallucis longus, have both selected, yes, no, maybe not, okay. Well, not my best weekend. Okay, extensor digitorum longus, and I think at this point I was burning out, not, oh, this is the part I wanted to show you that I missed. Do it again. The uh, fibularis longus and fibularis brevis. Come on, show it. Don't extensor hallucis longus, extensor digitorum longus, and there we go. Here we go. Okay. So now, what 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 am I doing? Why aren't I clicking on the? Uh, Flexor digitorum longus. Okay, I got that. Oh, I see. Yeah, I wanted to show you what they both look like together. Flexor digitorum longus and extensor digitorum longus, which is the one. Oh, actually, this would this would be the flexor. The one on the top of the foot is the extensor. So, my bad. Uh, goodness gracious, I have totally jumbled this whole thing. Well bugger. The first part's pretty good, but this part, not so exciting. Uh, I really want to show you this. I hope I click on it. There we go. Fibularis longus and fibularis brevis. Longus brevis, longus brevis. That's what I was trying to do this whole time. Now I think the video's over, or at least I'm done talking. I need to go to bed. See you guys in the morning.